talk to the governor of that state as well. Governor Jan Brewer, a Republican from Arizona, joins us now. So, Senator McCain says in five years, maybe there's a commission, Governor. But what do you think so far? How, how do you feel about this border surge amendment and how the state's concerns are being considered here? Well, let me begin by saying, Jenna, that I'm really, really uh, am claiming victory for Arizona in regards to the border surge. I was... Um, writing to the federal government and to Senator Schumer way back in June of 2010 in regards uh, to the border surge that we needed to see completed uh, before we moved forward. So today, hopefully, that get, will get out of the Senate and we can see that they are going to move forward. So I'm very pleased about that. My concern, of course, at, as always has been, is that we don't want to have the same situation that's happened in the past. We need to see that the border is under somewhat of some type of operational control before anything else, I believe, should get passed. So what, um, what about accountability you know, there? Because I, I did ask Senator Corker about that on Friday, and he said once all of these different security uh, variables are in place, the border will be secure. And we've heard different things about apprehension percentages, for example, that will prove that the border is secure. How, how would you deem success of a secure border, Governor? Well, let me say first and foremost, I think a lot of the data that we've received in the past, you know, data can be whatever anybody wants to make it. The bottom line is, is I think that we need to rely on our border patrol. Uh, when they say that it's under operational control, our, our law enforcement, uh, the, board, uh, the, the border governors, um, people that are living it every day, day in and day out, they're the ones that should be able to call and say, this time the border is under operational control because we are the recipients of all the bad that takes place with the border sure. being have open. You been approached, the ones... Have you been approached at all by any lawmakers to be a part of the said commission in five years or been approached in any way to talk about how you would hold the federal government accountable for this new border surge? Well, certainly I've been in contact with Senator McCain and, and Senator Flake and my congressional delegation. I was just recently on the phone with Matt Salmon, who is uh, working diligently over in the House to come up with solutions. So hopefully together, as this bill moves out of the Senate and gets over to the, to the House, we can come up with a solution for and, the United States of America. And that's a big question. But we just, that live on... Sure. Let me just add, I only have about a minute here. I just want to get this final question in because it's been a big topic of conversation for our viewers and some also lawmakers about the debate about more big government, another big bill, another big federal program. How do you feel about that, Governor? Is, is this the wrong move when we look at it in that sort of prism, if you will? You know, this is a big issue, so it probably needs a big bill, but let's hope that they read it with a fine-tooth comb. Uh, in the past, we haven't had a lot of good... Uh, uh, reason to believe that they read those great big bills. So someone better be going through it with a fine tooth comb and do it right this time. They need to do it right. We look forward to checking back in with you as we see what happens to the amendment this evening and also the bill overall when it goes to the House. That's a big question. Governor Brewer, always nice to have you on the program. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you, Jenna.